Hey guys, welcome back to the MCU HQ. The Shang Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings teaser is finally out, meaning marketing for the movie has finally begun. And it is after almost two years, it is nice to finally see something from this movie. So let's watch this. This is one of the things I'm most excited for in Phase 4. They better tie Iron Fist into this. The Mandarin. Do you look sick? I'll dig that logo. Oh. We made a good team. <laughs> All right. It looks different, which is good. It's something new. Um, I was hoping for a shot of him in his costume, but I mean, I guess that's what the poster's for. Uh, from what I saw, the fight choreography looks good, so there will be some good fights, which, I mean, in a martial arts movie, one of the top three things you need is... I, in a martial arts movie, like, top thing you need is a really good looking fight. And I did see like a giant battle at one point. It looked like there were like just a ton of like horses, I guess, going at each other. Awesome. I love big battles. And a look at the Mandarin, although in marketing they're calling him Wen Wu, even though we know he's the Mandarin because Kevin Feige said that at Comic Con. And I bet in maybe a sequel, they tie Iron Fist into this. It would be the perfect, um, it'd be the perfect franchise to bring Iron Fist into. I, I think we're gonna rewatch it. There were some, there were some lines in there they were saying that I missed because I was talking. Um, but this is one of the, um, one of the Phase Four projects I'm most excited for. You look sick.
and it's Siegel Lee's birthday today. That's some good timing on the trailer. All right. Yeah. I do think the one thing the trailer is missing was a clear look at the suit. I mean, we got one, but it was so quick that it just looked like what he was normally wearing. I, I think a good thing to have in a lot of superhero movie trailers um, is a shot at their outfit. I mean, we kind of had one Doctor Strange of him walking, the, the end shot of him walking, but I think that was enough. Um, yeah, I think that's what it could have used. But other than that, I thought that this, was, this was a good trailer. It didn't give away the story. It teased it a little bit. We got to see the, um, we got to see like every character. We got to see some of the fighting, which is what they would want to focus on. I might need to pick up some Shang-Chi Shang -Chi comics and learn about this guy. He seems lit. Well, guys, that's my reaction to the trailer for Shang-Chi and The Legend of the Ten Rings. What are your thoughts on the trailer? Are you excited for the movie? Let me know down in the comments below. Also, leave a like on this video, subscribe, click on the bell icon to receive all notifications from the MCU HQ. That's going to be it. Have a great day, guys.